Hello and welcome to this video where today I want to talk to you about understanding the impact of the type of installation that you're going to have with your Landsweeper installation. The choices you have is going to be the easy installation path or the advanced installation path. And of course, besides the typical advanced installation paths that allow you to modify the ports for HTTP or HTTPS, uh, the installation path and, and the database path, there's a deciding factor when it comes down to the, the type of uh, database that you want to install here. The database is going to be that key piece. The easy installation path includes the SQL local DB, which has a 10 gig limitation, as well as a limitation that does not permit external connections coming into it. So everything needs to be done internally on that local host itself. So when we're looking at this, the, the, the limitations to um, the, the database are primarily gonna be around the number of assets. By default, typically a single asset is about one megabyte. So 10,000 assets, you're looking at about a 10 gig database. So if your license is over 10,000, I would encourage you and, and recommend that you do an advanced installation. If you have an installation that has roughly 6,000 assets, you're getting pretty close to that point where you probably want to start considering having a second installation of Landsweeper, excuse me, a second, not a full installation, but a separate scanner installation of Landsweeper. That separate scanner can help do some load balancing and help to, to, to alleviate some maybe some scanning latencies and other issues that might be going on. The typical, um, the, the typical number of assets we recommend that you scan is about four to 6,000 assets on a single scan server. So you start getting to that upper end of 6,000, really should be recommend getting into another scan server. So with that, then you would need to have the advanced installation and a separate SQL database. So I, I think honestly that that is gonna be the biggest deciding factor when you're coming into which installation is gonna be right for you, which installation method, the advanced or the easy, is really gonna be dependent upon that asset and the asset count in the SQL database. I hope that it's helpful in helping you to decide the type of installation you should uh, go for. If you have other questions, please reach out to our sales team. They'll be glad to help you walk through some scenarios that might be best for your situation. I look forward to you seeing you on the next one. Take care.